Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's VMP and we are back. This time, as you can see, with a little more Perizno. It's been a little bit, because uh, I've been having a lot of fun with the new Prophecy of Pendor series, but uh, this is going to be the other series we're going to be focusing on for the time being, at least until we finish it, and I don't, we, I don't think we have uh, too much left in this series. Our goal, uh, for at least this season of Perizno, was to destroy the Reich, retake all their lands, well not retake, but <laughs> take all their lands from them. Uh, we succeeded in taking out Kaiser Odo, the king that betrayed us in the very beginning, and that's what really sent us on this journey. So uh, we're doing pretty good, I'd say. Pretty good indeed. Uh, last episode at the end we noticed Ufiona, that's how I'll, how I'll uh, pronounce his name I suppose, we noticed him over here with a pretty sizable Volhir army, 140 Volhir Berserkers. So what we're going to do is we're going to let him battle it out against these Ilka Falki. Hopefully, hopefully he actually takes them out and takes a bunch of them prisoners so then we can just go in, rescue all those prisoners and get a ton of Ilka Falki right off the bat. So we're going to go over here and check it out. See what happens. They might actually win. I'm not too sure. Oh, okay. Well, if they're going to go in and help him, then they're definitely going to win, I think. That's a no-brainer. All right. Uh, I guess we might as well go in and help now. Move in to help the Ilka Falki. Let's do it. 334 against 182. Should not be, should not be too bad. All right. Let's go ahead and charge on in here. Got to clear my desk a little bit some uh, arm range here so we can pull off all that fancy combat stuff. Alright, yeah, so just a bunch of all here. Not too big of a deal. Just out a little bit. Alright, alright. be alright. A bunch of berserkers. Who else is actually raiders? The raiders are shit. 66 is going to fit in. Expect a lot more. Even the, the berserkers are worth uh, 200. They're doing a decent job against the uh, weaker post rocket though, which isn't too big of a surprise. They can't really damage us much, but they haven't hurt our horse a little bit. There we go. Ah, there we go. Now we're killing them pretty good. Just a bunch of the old Falcon going down, which I don't really care because they're not even part of our back. Not, not even too big of a deal. Unfortunately, it doesn't separate Ally from uh, our own personal troops here, so I can't really tell. We are, I do believe we are losing some troops here, but I don't think, I don't think too many. Not enough that I'm worried about it, at least. This is a rather large army, though, so I wouldn't be surprised if we ended up losing a bunch of troops out of this. Here goes our horse. Oh, it's triple. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> we all know. Anyone who's watched my videos for long knows that that won't last. I just can't help it sometimes. Alright, let's go take this horse. That was a little weird. <laughs> Easy. Uh, yeah, so I apologize for not being able to uh, upload a video. Last weekend, um, at least I don't think I did. Not as much as I should have. Uh, it's because I got one. It was my homecoming, uh, so I was preoccupied with that dance, and I worked two six-hour shifts, both on Saturday before homecoming and then Sunday night after homecoming. So that was a lot of fun. <laughs> I was pretty exhausted by the end of that. Oh yeah, we only lost one, an eagle retainer. That's fine. Allies lost sixteen. Enemies lost 108. Oh yeah, so that shh, we did fine. Only 74 from left, and probably most of them won't even be the berserkers at this point. I'm charging. Good. Yeah. So, uh, in case you guys don't know, I work at um, uh, the local Hollister store at the mall, and that last weekend was something called inventory, where we have to count and scan every single item in the store of which there are quite literally thousands. Perhaps even 
and the Pentile was just, like, it was ridiculous. And, uh, got there at 4, and went to, like, about midnight. So, no, that was more than 6 hours, that was, like, 8 hours. So, that was fun. But, I mean, it actually wasn't too bad. Uh, it was just kind of busy work, it wasn't, like, hard work or anything like that. And uh, it was just a bunch, a bunch of the other people were there as well, so we could just talk while we we're doing it. Of course, uh, talking a little bit too much wasn't too bad or too good of an idea because if you lose count while you're in the middle of a stack of a hundred plus shirts, yeah, not fun to start over. That that happened several times. <laughs> but uh, someone brought like a big bag of cookies. Another person brought like uh, a couple pizzas. So. We take breaks every now and again and uh, chow down on that, so it wasn't too bad. It was not too bad at all. Of course, waking up the next morning was not fun. Uh, I'm pretty sure this past week, on average, I fell asleep around 2 or 3 a.m. For, for a lot of the time, no reason. Uh, I was just, I'd just be like staying up, like playing games or something like that. Not smart, but uh, oh well. <laughs> Finally caught up on sleep now. So that's all good. Alright, some nice prisoners here. Uh, do we need these? Uh, let's take the riders. Alright, down he goes. Alright, let's head over to Smell Cotton because that's what our goal for this episode is. To finally take Smell Cotton. Took out Otto, Kaiser Otto the fourth. Now Smell Calden, this is ripe for the pickings. He is back, but he doesn't have his army. He has, does have quite a few vassals in there, but I think we can take it. Let's see how many. How much are we looking at here? Four hundred. Um, I'm guessing five to five hundred fifty troops here. Not too bad. We can definitely do it. Oh, it's, it'll probably take us several attempts, but that's fine. Actually, hold up. Whoa, whoa. Oh, sorry. Party, I need to... Oh, I do have the marksmen, eagle retainers, Bucky rangers. Oh, heavy marksmen. Those should be there before the eagle retainers. Is that good? I think that should be all right. Okay. A little bit more, wait for the morning. There we go. <laughs> oh boy, this is big. This is their main their main town. Let's do it. <laughs> this is gonna be good, guys. This is gonna be good. Even if we fail, still be good. Whoa! We are alright, hold on, everyone follow me. We are, we spawn way the hell away from here. Holy shit. Look how far we are. It's ridiculous. Alright, uh, <laughs> I'll, uh, a quick uh, cut to where we actually get there. Alright, here we are, pretty close to the gate here. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and I think tell people to, whoops, that's not what I wanted, hold your fire. I don't think we're close enough yet. But where? I don't see the ladder. Are we supposed to go to the gate? Alright, guys, go ahead and. Never mind, go ahead and fire. We're gonna try to take a few shots here. With our ridiculously long uh, <laughs> draw time. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna go up close and try to scout things out. Uh, you guys stay here. I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Are we supposed to? I know in the Clash of Kings mod, you used to have to beat down these gates. Do they do the same thing? <gasps> Is a vine Aisling got a kill? What? How are we supposed to uh, get through here? Is my question. Huh. 
It's honestly confusing. Oh look, there's a bunch of bodies. Lovely. Um, how? Yeah. This is confusing to say the least. Um. Oh wait, hold up. I think I see it. There's a big clump of troops on the radar, on the mini map, on this side of the castle. So I'm guessing that that might be where the. Yeah. I have a feeling it's over here, around the corner. Which is kind of annoying, not gonna lie. But, uh, we'll just make that trek. That's fine. Alright, come on. Got one. Whew! Yeah. <laughs> These guys aren't gonna be able to hold back Onyx. He has uh, quite the rage involved with <laughs> the Reich right now. It is not like being made a fool of. And that's what the Kaiser did when he uh, made us slaughter a bunch of our own, well not slaughter a bunch of our troops, but uh, ride our troops into a massacre and lose hundreds of troops taking out those Draken Priesters and then never paid us for it, never rewarded us. So he's gonna, he, <laughs> he deserves what's coming to him. Right, let's keep Keep our army moving towards here. Please tell me this is where it is. Yes, see, there it is. Alright. Well, we know where it is now. Now it's just a matter of taking it. That should be the easy part, right? Not quite. Not quite. Uh, I don't see many people, though. Oh, here they are. Hello. I'm trying to mess with you right now. Sit down, punk. Oh, Kaiser Lich. Can't mess around. Can I shoot you? Probably not. I don't think so. You keep on darting around. You can make up your mind about where you want to go. Look at that person shooting at us. Go ahead and go right here. Archers, I want you to stay right here, but infantry charge, cavalry charge. There we go. Alright, let's do it. Shall we lead the charge? Probably not a smart idea, actually. Thinking about it? That'd be very foolish idea, actually. So we'll get slaughtered. And our best our best way to contribute is to be just part of the wave. Oh man, definitely do not want to fall in there, so I don't want to get back out. Oh, actually, yes, you probably do. Let's go back in. Ooh, Baron Kurtz going ham on us here. He's gonna take out Baron Kurtz. That's three of us he's killed. Not killed. He's not even coming. Should be able to jump out of here, though, right? Yeah, we're good. We're good. Our guys are just still bound them. They're making their way, making their way in. And once they clear out a little area, we can hop in and do our do our business. That's what we're looking for. So, you guys have to let me know in the comments. There's been this game that I've been watching, two places of that I really think looks cool. Uh, called Crusader Games. Um, I don't know if I'd do a series on it, I think I definitely, it uh, looks like it has a steep learning curve, but I definitely want to play around with it a little bit before I try to do a series on it, it's not something you want to do like a blind playthrough on, um, but if you guys have played it in the comments, let me know what you think about it, like if there's a lot of replayability, like if it's still fun after playing it a couple times, like Mountain Blade, <laughs> I think that's the true mark of a good game, is if you can continue to play it, like, 
a game like Watch Dogs, you're not gonna have a thousand hours on that. Like once you've played it through, you're done. Mountain Blade, I'm pretty sure I'm up to about a thousand hours now. Oh, we barely blocked that last one. Do we have troops coming in? Maybe we should have our archers still up here. So they're coming back. That'll be good. damage, not bad. Ooh. Picking off the dragon. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, hello. Oh, here's a priester. Oh, man. Those priests are pretty brutal. Alright, they took him out. Alright, it's time to go down and take out these archers. shouldn't be doing this, but we are. a surprise for next season. We, I mean, we did get Flamebringer and Kingslayer this season, so that's pretty good on magic weapons, I'd say. Right, our guys are almost here. Our reinforcements. Our rider, how many have we killed so far? 124 of them. I really want to keep on pressing. I think that's really necessary. Because otherwise, it would it's going to take so many uh, attacks. If we only take out a hundred each time, it'll take us a solid four attacks or so. Whereas we keep on pushing, if we were to defeat like all three of the waves or all four of the waves, then then we'd only have to probably take out about half that. Only about 250 troops, I'd say. Maybe 300. Unfortunately, with how low our health is, I don't know if that's going to be possible. Especially with us trying to uh, go commando on him out here. Well, alright, I take that back. Since I doubt we're going to be able to take out all of them in this run, we will have taken out a lot of their elite units, like the Dragoners. So the second and third runs will be a lot easier. But we really haven't lost that many of our good units. Alright, another wave down. 
down. It is a pretty brutal slaughter, I'm not gonna lie. But imagine defending this. Like, if we had our entire archer force on these walls for that entire long walk that they have to try to take us out, Jesus, they'd be screwed. They'd be shot out long before they even stood a chance. Oh, sweet. Alright, we actually have reinforcements now. We might be alright. We might be alright here. Oh, jeez, hello. Still have a priester. No, no longer do they have a booster. At least not that particular one. I'm sure they're probably not. They got plenty of backup. Ooh, cavalry going down. Archer, another archer. Another archer, another archer. Oh man. That kill feed though. See, now that we're in open combat, it's over for these guys. So, Dragoner. Not gonna happen today, Dragoner. Oh, Dragon Grid. I've heard of them before. I think those are a specialty unit of one of the lords. You're going down. Rider, you too. Oh. I don't think so. Elite Dragon Shorf shoots. I just saw a dude fall off the wall. Nice. Oh, is there a second keep? A second wall we have to go into? Oh no way. That is sick. And out they come. Damn. Oh man. That is crazy. I was wondering where they were because I didn't see them. I thought they were just hiding around like a corner behind one of the farms or something. I guess not. How did, wait, how did I kill that guy behind the dragoner? That makes some complete sense. Oh, we need to back off a little bit. I'm not trying to take on that full wave at once. Yeah, that archer's got his eyes on us, but that's too bad for him. So we have a shield. Cavalry? Don't think so. Not today. Not today, at least. Oh boy, this is not good. At least our archers are still pounding away at him. Come here. Your hard camel rider. That's what I thought. Can I distract some of you? I just want a few of you coming. Thank you. Come here. No, come back. Come back. Come on, we're having fun. We're just about to. Ooh, took out your friend and you. Yeah, buddy. That's what I'm talking about. Don't try to run right past me. It's almost like they don't recognize me. It's kind of hard to miss me. I mean, we are soaked in blood right now. The blood of our enemies runs red. I mean, it'd be a little creepy if it ran up. Any other, any other uh, color. It'd be aliens or some shit. Hit anybody. Here we go. Come on. Got him once. Got him twice. Oh, there goes a priester. Oh, we got a couple priesters helping us out. Who's our I think I'm going to new uh, Lord Trooper recruited. I'm sure it's helping us. Legs. We went through our last legs a while ago. In fact, we don't know how we're still up. 
Oh man, we've killed so many. I wish I had looked at how many kills we had before the siege and after. Because it's probably going to be ridiculous. Like we, us personally, Onyx himself must have at least taken out 100 troops here so far. We're at 276. Is this their last? This might be their last wave. There's a lot of Drahan camel riders. Those are, like, they're pretty decent units to have so many of them. Ah, oh, boy. Alright, just charge in. Help us. I need your help. I trapped a few of them. Like here. I'm killing him with one hit, which did not happen. Did not happen. Man, Onyx is really putting his name in history books here. He deserves to own the Reich at this point. If a king can do this by himself, he deserves it. Oh, yep, that's it. That's it. That was their last wave. We did it. Oh, my God. Ooh. Ooh, wee. Come on. What do we have left? Looks like someone in here. I want to check this area out. What is this? Oh, this is the actual town proper. Wow. That is really cool. I, I'm not even going to lie. That is really cool. Where is this last troop, though? That, however, is not so cool. Somewhere over here. It would appear. Oh, okay. Getting close. What? An assassin standing on the roof of a stall? What? Is that real? <laughs> Oh my god, let's go try to assassinate him. We are going to Assassin Creed's. <laughs> what? Assassin's Creed, this bitch. Why don't any of our archers need to be out? Here we go. Let this be the one. One strike. No! <laughs> we missed! Alright, we're gonna try that again. We're gonna try it again. <laughs> Oh shoot, we like landed on top of him almost. Alright, alright, alright. Rewind, rewind, rewind. Alright, come on, on my ways, guys. Then we're just gonna have to shoot him. Alright, we're gonna stick on this one first. Missed him. But he didn't see us coming. Assassination. <laughs> Alright, uh, one person left. Where are they? Over here. Okay. Interesting. Let's go, boys. I swear, if they make us fight through the town, they probably are gonna make us fight through the town. God damn it. <laughs> we, that's what we're doing right now. We're gonna have to do the same thing twice. Oh, well. That's fine. Whoa. Onyx is busting a move right here. Like, he is spreading. Spang, these guys look slow. No, he's in more armor. Where's he at? Oh, here he is. <laughs> and Victor. Oh, man, that was brutal. That was a brutal kill right there. Wow, we only lost six. Our allies, however, lost 25. That's pretty rough, but it was definitely worth it. Alright, we have to deal with them in the heart of the town. Let's go, boys. Let's finish this off. One time for the one time. Alright, I'm gonna go over here. You guys. Fight. Come on. Let's go. Do something. I'm gonna go hunt for these guys. Where are they at? Oh, here you are. Barely got our shield up in time for that, actually. We did not regain a lot of help from that. Our wound treatment skills will not be the greatest. Two more are you this way. Whoa. There's no main recruit was killed. Okay. Come on, Drahan Storm Archer. You got this. Finish that finish that last one off. Please. There we 
go. Good job. Where's your friend at? Here he is. And shank. Alright, so yeah, that was a lot faster. This has to be a custom made castle, and that's absolutely amazing. Like the detail they put into it, like that's a really awesome map right there. Killed one of our Sakai Raiders. That's not one of ours. <laughs> As if we'd have a Sakai Raider in our group. Oh, oh shit! Alright, we gotta be careful here. They killed our troops. <laughs> I was joking around about that. Man, that would have been terrible if they took us out from behind and we had lost because of that. That would have been horrible. <laughs> I've never had that happen to me. I don't know what actually happens when you lose there. I suppose that'd probably be interesting to know. Stop, I yield to you. Alright. We'll let you all go. We're going to let you all go. Uh, because I would like all of you to join me once I finish off. Okay, get your horse out of my face. I'd like them all to join us once we're done here. Baron Chingus, we have a, re a relation of 79 with him. Oh, Lady Antiope really likes us for that. Very good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about right there. Here are the true spoils of war. Yeah, this is going to give us all the people we need uh, to keep on attacking the last remaining castles and to station troops here. That was very good. Oh man, it feels good to finally take Small Cow and it always felt like kind of an untakeable castle. But I guess not. I guess not. Alright. Almost done here. There were some pretty good units sprinkled in there, actually. Obviously a bunch of crap units for the most part, but some not bad ones either. Ooh, Wolf Constable. Hell yes. Look at Falcon units, nice. Who are we gonna give Smalk out to? Of course, from that entire siege, only uh, <laughs> nine things to uh, loot. Makes complete sense. Out of like 400 bodies. Alright. Uh, who do we want to give this to? Uh, see, Lord Shigan is already devoted. Let's give it to Lord Aricanus. Uh, Lord Alfred isn't too happy with us. But that's... Not my problem. And Lady Antiope is either. Lord Alfred and Lady Antiope. Alright. All of our vassals can have some. So that made them at least a little bit happier with us. Uh, let's sell all this stuff. Whoops. Bop, bop, bop. Bop, bop. Oh, that's kind of a cool helmet. Yeah, it is a really cool looking helmet. Too bad it isn't better, better than what we have. But, oh well. Uh, not much here, really. Thick round dragon shield. That looks pretty cool, too. Uh, why does all the Reich stuff have to suck? Now we have, all right, our horse got lame, so we're going to bench it for now. Um, we'll take our courser back, so that'll be extra fast. Spirited Holy War Horse, 56 and 45? Holy shit. 56 armor, 45 speed, 46 maneuver, 36 charge, 175 hit points. That is pretty ridiculous. As is this one. Not quite as fast, but 64 armor. Jeez. Huh. Well, I don't think we need more horses at this point, but... Maybe we should have brought a uh, flame ringer on that last battle. Oh well. Let's buy all the bread. We got so much money right now, it doesn't even matter. We can throw cash. Alright, so let's go ahead and give the crap units here. Bop, bop, bop. Uh, there's no recruits. 
keep it definitely keeping the uh, uh we don't want him definitely keeping the wolf constable though they are very nice very nice indeed demon worshiper meh Uh, wolf Knight will keep. Wolf Page? No. Not a Praetorian card. You look good enough. I don't think they'll probably siege us back because we just destroyed so many of their vassals it's ridiculous. But they might try. Uh, Mercenary Shadow Guard? We'll keep him. He's pretty cheap. So now the question is Uliastai is under siege. So, do we want to deal with him, or, hmm, do we want to deal with that, or just go on and keep on destroying the Reich? Um, tell you what, I'm going to go ahead and cut the recording for a little bit, finish dropping off all these troops, and I'll be right back. Alright, guys, so, finish that off, Smaukow now has 102 in its garrison, which is pretty good. We're rocking 154 in our army. And uh, actually, now I'm thinking about it, let's quick go to the tavern and sell off all these merchants, right? Or, uh, sell off all these merchants. Sell off all these prisoners to the merchant right quick. There we go. Take him. And ooh, those guys are worth quite a bit. Very nice. Even though we have more money than we're really possibly going to use here. But, you know, it's all good. Book motion, anything, anything good in here? I'm probably too stupid to read all these, let's be honest. <laughs> what is Onyx's intelligence? 11. I guess that's not horrible. Alright. So, we're going to go ahead and head over and help Ulias die out. I'm not worried about the Reich kind of retaliating at this point. At least not for a while. And I don't think we have two... Oh, no, we're not. Mm -mm. Peace, don't think so. I'm not too worried about us. Let's hop in right here. How many do they, do they have? Okay, join the battle. Let's... What? That's a ton of reinforcements. Is it all just reinforcements that are attacking us? Is that what's going on? Jeez. Oh, wow. The frame rate is real here. I'm not sure what's going on with that. I felt, I felt a little bit as we were getting rid of mercenaries. I'm not sure what's, uh, what's up with that. Alright. Oh, well. Um. Hmm. Alright, hold up. Hold up. Wait, wait a minute. Alright, well. <laughs> Finished the siege off there. Not sure why the frame rate happened. Um, it's possible I still have a bunch of raw footage maybe still saved and we're running out of space. Not too sure. Uh, it was a pretty easy siege defense. Uh, we only lost five troops, allies, the garrison lost five as well, taking out 148 of them. It was pretty easy. Just sat there, kind of plucking them off. And, uh, oh, hello. Emperor Hacken the second. Uh, we should probably capture him and ransom him off, I think. Uh, yes. We will be doing that. Definitely. Um. <laughs> the Reich doesn't like us for that, neither does the Hacking Empire, but, uh, that's what you get for attacking us. That's all I can say. So let's go ahead and capture all those enemies here, and I think we'll go ahead and end the episode off there on that note. Uh, basically, everything that could have gone right did this episode <laughs> took out small count in uh, a single siege didn't have to go for multiple attacks on it the first attack we made it all the way through killed over 330 of them something ridiculous like that and then we came over and defended Ilias die pretty nice pretty nice indeed I'd say uh, some soldiers are ready to upgrade and uh, all right come on Oh, yes. We are definitely out of space. <laughs> Alright. Well, there you have it, guys. Um, as always, leave me some comments down below and let me know what you're thinking uh, about all the series I have going on right now. 
I'm thinking about probably focusing on this and the new Prophecy of Pandora series until this one is finished off. Probably this one, I'm seeing a couple more episodes left. Probably around four, maybe? Yeah, we'll say around four. Um, if we can aim to take uh, one of the Reich's castles, or remaining castles or towns each episode, I'd say that we'd, we'd be doing a pretty good job. So, there you have it, guys. As 